Okay, I'm going to show you today how to use an app called VDownload Plus to download clips from YouTube and save them onto your iPad. This is very useful if you are going to be in an area where you don't have Wi-Fi or you're not sure about the Wi-Fi and you want to make sure that you have the clips that you need for whatever presentation or lesson you might need them for. So first of all, we're going to open the app up. And as you can see in here, there's a few things that I can do. Right now I'm already in YouTube. I can search for anything on the internet up here. I've already created a search for the fit principle. I'm going to have a look and find a video that fits my needs. Select that video, and as soon as it gets ready to start playing, it's going to ask me if I want to save it to memory, which I do. If, I, if I'm not quite sure and I want to watch it a little bit more, I can tap on the cancel button. Maybe after a little while I decide I want to, I'm going to select the save button at the bottom here and save it to memory. And you'll see over here at the bottom corner, the downloads queue. This video is going to download to this point here. And I'm going to tap on the download thing. And you can see in the top here that it has just about downloaded. Now I have a couple of options. I'm just going to go back and stop the video so I can have the background. I can play it by pressing the green play button on the right hand side there. So now it's ready for me. Or if I don't want to play it right now, I can also choose to download it by pressing the arrow on the right hand side here. Now because this is a clip from YouTube, it's going to ask me do I want to save it to memory, but what I'm probably about to discover is that it won't let me because YouTube doesn't allow you to do that. That's okay though, it's still on my iPad. If I find a clip and I want to download it and edit it and so on, I can use a different app called iCab Mobile and that will allow me to save it directly into my camera bank and then I can upload it to an app such as Coach's Eye and analyze it from there.